Hey guys, welcome back. I don't know how long the last episode lasted, and I don't know how long this is on going to last. Last time we lost three aircraft carriers, one of them a battleship, two of them actual. Uh, in return, we sank two Japanese aircraft carriers, probably the only ones in the area, too. As far as I know. Um, so I don't think the Lexington is in too much danger. But hell, I don't think the Enterprise is in that much danger, either. Or I didn't think the San Francisco was in that much danger, I mean. He's dead. So. What you gonna do about it? Hmm. So. Take this guy, and I think he should be ready to strike. The able. Is that strike supposed to hit around night? We might just cancel that strike. In fact, we are going to cancel that strike. I don't want a night force being hit. Right. Cross group 142 worries me. There is no command task group anymore. It's really only our goal of getting these guys to Supply Wake Island. Run this simulation till 5, at which point we'll take our last carrier and tell them all to get ready. What do you got on you, anyway? The Flussler, the Lambson, the Porter, the Talbot, and the Drayton. Hmm. More strikes at wake. No contact so far. We'll leave these guys in closer to wake. We managed to supply wake. So that was good. One hour left. Time's up. Let's see how we did. I think. Eventually. Hey, Yay! We won! Hey. I have no idea how we won, but we did! Let's uh let's let's see. We managed to resupply Wake Island, which was our main main goal anyway. Uh, keeping these guys alive was important, but not... Actually, it was pretty damn important. Um, if we lost all three of them, we would have had only a draw. Luckily, we managed to keep the Lexington floating, while losing the Enterprise and the Saratoga, which, while crippling losses, we will be able to withstand. Um, especially considering the fact that Pretty sure we managed to sink right, managed to sink the Suryu and the Hiryu, which are Japan's two main carriers in the Pacific at this point in time. So though we lost two carriers, we traded it for two Japanese carriers. And for any of those of you who know the history of World War II, that's bad for Japan. Japan doesn't have a massive industrial base. We have a massive industrial base. We can replace the Enterprise. They can't. We sunk three ships. We damaged six. 
They sank four. They sank the Enterprise, the Saratoga, and the San Francisco, but the San Francisco was kind of a an aircraft carrier we had. It was, it was more a battleship with a runway on it. Um, they destroyed a lot of our airplanes. A lot of our airplanes. But they just never got that invasion off. And if they didn't do that, it was an allied decisive... Our only goal was to keep Japan from making it to Wake Island. And we did. So... Yay, victory! This was Carriers at War. If you guys want to see more of this, let me know. I Honestly, I love this game. This has probably got to be one of my favorite games. Let's, uh, let's see what the Japanese could see. Um, up near Wake, nothing left. And down here in the south. Yeah, they lost the Chikuma, Suryu, the Hiryu. That entire thing, we spotted it and I was right. I managed to get off that Alpha Strike and nail the Suryu with their planes on the deck, which really crippled their um, combat air patrols. Which, uh, I, I, I don't know. Or maybe it was the Hiryu. We crippled the Hiryu. And, jeez, I don't know, just... That was the deciding factor, was we found them first. So we were able to sink them. Uh... I'm guessing we found this guy at some point in time. I'm not sure what sank him. Something. Something had to. The only aircraft carriers Japan had available at that point in time. Got completely destroyed. And we have one carrier left. So technically we've won. I guess they all fled down here towards Namur. We missed him in the night. Anyway, this has been Carriers at War. I've been Admiral Tomato. I'll see you all, if you all want to see me, in the next part.